Hey guys, I know it's been a minute, so I wanted to come to you and do a product review today and kind of a quick link check of how my hair is looking. Um, I planned on doing a massive list of reviews this week um, since I'm off work, but that didn't happen. Sleep kind of took over. But um, anyways, I'm going to do one for you today, and the product that I'm going to be reviewing is this good stuff. It's the uh, Curl Junkie Hibiscus and Banana Honey Butter. Um, it's a leave-in conditioner for thick curls and coils. Um, and it states on the back, add moisture, weight, and control to your precious curls and coils. Can also be used on damp hair for two-strand twist outs and braids. Um, the directions state that it is best uh, when used on wet, freshly conditioned hair and to smooth a small amount through hair lengths and style as usual. Um, so I have used this product for both two strand twist as my styler and also as a leave in um, for after I do my wash and go. So this is the consistency. Um, you guys can see that. It's kind of an opaque kind of color. It's really thick and creamy. And this is the consistency of it. Not as thick as cottage cheese, but it, that's what it kind of reminds me of. The smell is fabulous. It smells so good, y'all. Oh, it smells so good. It's like banana and I guess hibiscus. I don't know, but it but it smells it smells great. Um it's eight fluid ounces, and I believe it was twenty or twenty-two dollars. I don't remember. I brought it. I bought it from uh, Curl Mart. It was somewhere uh, within that range. But um, like I said, I have used this both as a leave-in um, and as a styler for my um, two-strand twist. Um, as far as the two-strand twist, um, I did it on wet hair. Uh, the next morning when I took my twists out, my twists were very defined. Uh, they were very, very moisturized, um, and they were really tightly coiled. It wasn't loose. Um, it was pretty, pretty tight, um, and the style probably held for about two to three days. That's really as long uh, of a period as I, as I will go as far as my twist outs um, because I like to retwist them um, every couple days. But um, the definition was really nice, like I said. The hold was probably a medium hold, um, not as heavy as some of the other stylers I've used, but that's totally okay. Still did the job. Now, as far as my wash and goes, I did a wash and go this morning. Uh, not the best picture, probably, but yeah. I did a wash and go this morning, so I conditioned my hair, and I used this as my leave-in. I do really like this product because it states that it adds weight and it definitely does that for me. Um, it kind of weighs my hair down a little bit. I like that look a little bit better. Um, and it plays well with other products. I uh, used this as my leave-in and I applied my Eco Styler Gel for my gel. And then on top, I used the curls in a bottle. I love this stuff also. I'll do a review on it a little bit later. So my wash and go should last me um, a couple days. This is, uh, I said I did a wash and go this morning. Actually, this is second day wash and go. I did my wash and go yesterday. So um, this is how it looks. I am really, really happy um, with the Curl Junkie line. I was kind of iffy about it at first when I ordered. I didn't know, mm, I'm not sure if this is going to work for my hair, what's going to happen, but I really, really like it. Um, Ugh, this leave-in, y'all, it just smells so good. Oh, I just love it. The curls in a bottle, it's great for frizz. I kind of put it in my mirror, middle area and kind of rub it around my hair. It works a whole lot with that kind of halo effect that you can get sometimes with frizz. And I really, really like that. And again, I'll do a review on product a little bit later. But um, curls in a bottle. I love it. Hope they have a sale soon so I can stock up. Um, as far as my hair, uh, I think it's doing pretty well. My wash and goes are looking a little bit better, a little bit more defined because I'm getting a little bit longer length to my hair. So I'm excited about that. 
plus the summertime's coming, so I get to try some of the Curl Junkie gels. I can't wait to try those. Um, right now, I'm just sticking with the Eco Styler Olive Oil, and I also really like the IC Fantasia Olive Oil Gel. I'll have to do a comparison review on the two of those um, to let you know how they are, but anyways, this is what my hair is looking like now. Two second day wash and go, like I stated. Uh... We're right there as far as the length is concerned. So a little bit longer to my nose. Um, the sides are getting a little longer. So we're out to here. Uh, almost to collarbone, I guess. I'm not really sure. Um, I really don't like doing length checks because, I don't know, I just don't like doing length checks. <laughs> I prefer to just uh, style my hair and see how my length is that way uh, versus doing length checks. But um, I am happy with the way my hair is progressing. See, I got a little bit of hang time there in the middle. Oh, God, I'm still getting used to this whole camera thing and where my hands are. Oh, sorry, Michael Jackson hand. Um, but anyways, yeah, um, yeah, I'm I'm happy with the way my hair is progressing, moving right along. Uh, I can't wait to see how it's going to look in a couple months as far as my length is concerned. I'm kind of at that odd length, uh, especially with my twist outs. Uh, they're kind of weird these days. I'll have to do a twist out so you guys can see how it's looking. I did do mini twists uh, one day last week and I left them in for a couple days and then I untwisted them and I really, really like um, how that looked. Um, it was a little bit more defined versus, you know, the 10 or 12 twists uh, throughout my hair and then letting them go. Um, the little twist came, gave me a little bit more definition. I really like that. But it took forever putting those mini twists in. I would love to enlist the help of my husband, but um, he's not having that. Maybe I'll see if my five-year-old can help me out. Um, but yeah, so this is my hair. I'm happy with it. And clap, clap. My mother is going to go natural. Woo! So excited. So I get to pass down some of the awesome tips that I've learned from you ladies and some of the things that I've picked up on the way on websites uh, and all that good stuff. So I'm really excited for her. I'm glad she's embarking on this journey. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys have a good one. Uh, we'll chat later. Talk to you later. Bye.